What's up guys, welcome back to the channel and today I'll be bringing you a brand new reaction video. Today's reaction video is going to be something new, NHRA, Fire Breathing Monsters. Now, a few people suggested this in my live stream um, the other day, NHRA, some sort of drag racing. I haven't seen much of drag racing at all, but I'm into my Formula 1, obviously into my NASCAR, which you guys have seen, and I just love sport in general. So I'm very, very keen for this. I got told, I think in my live stream I got told it goes like 0 to 300 mile per hour in about 5 seconds. That sounds absolutely mental. So I'm very keen for this. This is my first time ever seeing anything like this. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button, guys. I upload general reaction videos to sport reaction videos, mainly focused on the US, sometimes Australian as well. And if that sounds something you like, hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. Let's try and hit, this is a completely new spot. So let's try and hit 50 likes on this video. I'm keen to check this out. I'm like, yeah, it's something new. So I have no clue what to expect. Let's go. Okay, I already like this sort of video. Building you up. Okay, I'm keen. I'm intrigued. What we got? I remember back when I was four or five years old, holding my dad's hand and watching the legends of the sports. Yeah, that's why we love sports. It, it inspires. Gladiators getting in these machines that were so unimaginable that made me want to go out and race. Awesome. It's insane of what we do. But what makes NHRA racing so special is the intensity. It's like being a manic depressant. It's just the highs of highs and the lows of lows. Well, it's perfect for my attention span. It's three and a half seconds of bad to the bone. <laughs> I get to four seconds and I'm like, ah, squirrel, parachutes, that's it. Love that. <laughs> oh, I look like a beast, the engine. Macho race car drivers tell you what it's like. You are hanging on for your life. You're talking four to five Gs like the space shuttle when it leaves the starting line. Wow, that is a lot of Gs, man. Oh, I'm like keen for this. Like rocket, you're getting over 320 miles an hour in just four seconds. Incredible. You know, it's music to my ears. Once I hear that starter spin over and hit the ignition Listen switch, to then it's, uh, it's time to roll. Wow. Oh, I did not expect that. <laughs> what? I get to go do a lot of other racing with some pretty cool race car drivers, some of the best in the world. They'll drive anything, but when you bring them out to a drag race, when you offer them to jump into a 10,000 horsepower funny car like I drive, they shake their head and they said, not a chance. Yeah, no way in hell I'd do that, man. Wow. Let me know how many people you normally get for this as well, because I know you guys go uh, mental for your motorsport. Sport in general, you just get a lot of people. That seems like quite a big people amount of people. Obviously, there's a limit on this because it's just one straight track and you can only fill that area. It's not like a NASCAR where you've got the whole oval to fit people in, if that makes sense. But still, there's a good crowd there and I imagine they're loving it. And this is one of those spectacles you have to see, man. Start wow. Start in the stands. The ground shakes underneath wow. you. It's that kind of horsepower that you're feeling. It's unbelievable. It's a runaway freight train. Look at that, man. These cars are animals, so you definitely have to respect them. No matter how comfortable you become or how confident you get, these things will yeah, turn around and slap you. Got a power shoot. They're going that quick. They have a power shoot behind them. Wow. That's what you were referencing before about the power shoot. Holy. Get a face and, uh, and make you look stupid. Oh, that must be scary as well when you're skidding. You got 20 different race teams out here, 20 different crews, 20 different crew chiefs, 20 different drivers, and yet we can come up with almost the same formula and go out on the racetrack and race within a thousandth of a second of each other at over 330 miles an hour. 330 miles an hour, man. The first time I ever got in one of these cars, I was scared to death. I've, you know, driven super comp cars, I've driven a fuel cars, but this is a whole different monster. When I yeah, them cars are mad as well. Like, I imagine there's a lot of videos on the modifications of them cars and potentially different classes. Is there different classes? Just because there's different types of cars there, you seem like normal, similar to NASCAR kind of cars there. And then you get in a thin, similar to F1 a little bit, but different beasts, completely different beasts. So let me know, guys. I'm, I'm all for learning and I definitely will get into this more because this looks insane. I hit the throttle. It parked me in the seat. It shoved me back and it was a G-force. That thing was carrying the, the noise running, of these truck. things. It's just an unbelievable piece of equipment and the fact that these crew guys can tear it down, rebuild a motor uh, in just under an hour uh, in between each round is pretty unbelievable. 
Indeed. Or giving the fans the pit access to watching these monsters get built, watching them get raced, watching them get torn apart again by the best men and women in the world that work on cars. Every ticket gets you right in here to the pit area. That's something that's uh, really unique that this sport has to offer over any oh, stick and ball cool. sport, cool. certainly over any other motorsport. Oh! That's sheer power, man. I put my helmet on, and once they sit me in a car and strap me, that's when Antron goes from, like I look now, to the gladiator face where you get serious and you get in the zone to go do battle. Yeah, see, that's for him. But for me, I'll get in my car and be all smiley. As soon as I go down, oh no, <laughs> I've actually got to go through to my now. I'd be absolutely crapping it. I really would. Fair play. Look at that, that man. I even want to beat my own daughter, Courtney, my youngest. She's a real pain to me. Oh, it's wow. It's always extra gratifying to beat the ones that, you know, are the best out here. Oh, you know, that's easy to be the best. Well, but nobody likes losing, and I have a hard time walking over and say, hey, good job beat me, buddy. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I don't want to do that. I care too much about it to lose easily like that. I love that. Winning, winning mentality. Absolutely love that. You're about to maybe make history. You're about to maybe time travel. You're maybe about to go out and explode an engine and catch fire. What? Yo, what have I just witnessed? What, like, what? Holy. You're about to maybe make history. You're about to maybe time travel. You're maybe about to go out and explode an engine and catch fire. That is insane. Let me know if that driver's okay, and let me know if there's been any fatalities recently. Hopefully not. Fingers crossed it's like, when I got into NASCAR, I was asking that question, and thank God it was non since 2001. But when you see stuff like that, that is scary. Let me know in the comments, guys. I'd really appreciate that. And let me know if you want to see the biggest engine explodes or whatever you call that. It seems like the engine explodes in the spot, so we'll do a reaction to that. That is mental. Man. It wasn't until I was almost coasting to a stop, I could hear the safety guys pull up in the truck next to me oh. yelling at me to pull the brake and stop the car. That's scary. Thank God all the safety stuff worked, but a um, heck of a way to end the night. Just a bit. <laughs> people that already created history, when you beat them, it gives you a little stripe on your belt because you're creating some history yourself. If you're beating the best, what does that make you? Makes you the best, baby. I love that. Winning mentality. You know, seeing that win light come on, knowing nobody can pass you in the points, it's over. You're the champion. Uh, you know, it doesn't get any finer than that. You're gifted with that moment, and that moment is huge when you got the right people behind you. Everybody has to be together on that same page. When you get that perfect unison, that's when championship teams are born. Oh. Listen to the roar of that man. The overpowering feeling you get watching one, let alone driving it, that pure awesomeness. I don't know what else to say. It made me want <laughs> to be a drag awesome, racer. It does seem awesome, man. It does. This is the extremest sport on the planet. We're the fastest sport in the world. This guy's the one that it down, and I love where it's headed. This is built for drag racing. Short. Effective and nasty. That literally sums it up perfectly. There's IndyCar, there's F1, there's Outlaw Racing. I'm not taking anything away from them, but the real difference is drag racing. It's the ride of a lifetime. I always say it's better than sex. But <laughs> how would I know at my age? Oh, wow. That is absolutely awesome. That is absolutely awesome. Oh, no, we've still got a minute left. It's not over yet. I thought it was going to be over, but it's not over yet. We're going to be surprised by anything else. Okay, it's just the end credits. I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. That is something new to me, and it's definitely something I'll be checking out again. Holy. That is scary, incredible, and awesome all at the same time. Let me know in the comments what you guys thought about it, because potentially you may not have seen it. It's weird how it's so dangerous and intense, and I've never heard about it before. At least with NASCAR, I'd heard 
of it. I'd never seen anything about it, but I'd heard of it. I knew there was such thing as NASCAR and F1 alternative in America, but I didn't know anything about it, if that makes sense. This, I'd never heard of in my life. And holy, it's definitely worth checking out again. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments any other videos you want me to react to. Hit that like button. Let's try and hit 50 likes on this video and have a fantastic day. Peace.